The machine that bounces on the floor, a new tool designed by hobbyists to start making it. You need to get some angle iron. The first step is to weld a square frame out of the angle iron. The motor will be installed inside the frame to power the machine. Two brackets will be made to support it. Once the work is completed, they will be fixed to each side of the motor. The finished product is an electric filter screen made from a discarded washing machine motor and some waste materials. Although the materials used are relatively simple, but the final product is quite practical. Now that the bracket is assembled, it is now ready to be welded to the finished frame. The four corners of the frame need four more springs welded to them. This spring will then be moved by the motor to achieve the shaking effect, but for a more pronounced shaking effect, a piece of iron will need to be attached to the motor housing. The motor will not be in a balanced position. The shaking effect will therefore be more pronounced. The next step is to make a bracket for the machine. The entire stand is made of welded galvanized square tubes. The dimensions are the same as the frame above. The stand will be used to increase the height of the machine to avoid the inconvenience of of not having enough height to operate the machine. In addition to this, it will also serve as an anchor with the bracket as a support underneath. Even when the screen above is shaking at high speed, the bracket below will be as stable as a mountain. Once the stand is assembled, a baffle is fitted from the crossbeam. The baffle is used to divert the filtered sand. A plastic basin is attached to the top of the motor to prevent the filtered sand from interfering with the motor. Finally, the top frame is fitted with a filter screen. The whole machine is now complete. When you need to filter sand on a construction site, you can place it next to the sand pile. The sand is then shoveled onto the top of the screen. The screen vibrates. The sand that needs to be filtered will automatically flow underneath. The whole thing is very practical. What do you think of this piece? Leave your thoughts in the comments section. See you next time.